In this video, we're going to take a look at how to use the slot commands in our 2D sketch environment. Now, the slot command is located on our rectangular and polygon flyout up here. So I'm going to grab the slot command, and I can see there's five different types I can choose from. I'm going to begin with the center to center slot. So here I specify a starting center point and then an end point. So basically, it builds it from the two center points of those curvatures to create that slot shape. The next one I'll do will be an overall slot. Here I choose a starting point, an end point, so far very similar, and then specify the overall. We also have a center point slot. Here I'll start at the origin of the file, go over here to the right a little bit, choose again, and there you can see it's coming from the center point to help me define my sizing. The other two involve using arc type slots. So here is a three-point arc slot. I'll start that one. I'll just kind of scoot over here a little bit. I'll pick the start of my arc slot, then the end of my arc slot, and then somewhere along the arc slot, and then the sizing here for the last input. Next up, we'll do a center point arc slot. Here I'll choose a center point down here. Starting point, ending point, and then the sizing of the slot as well. Now, again, these are general ways to create the slot. You might choose different methods based on what geometry you know. And as you're going through here and creating the slot, you could also input dimensional parameters to control the sizing. So, this has been a look at the slot tool inside of Autodesk Inventor.